This time around, we will be learning about a real time saver in Dreamweaver. In fact, I'll bet once you learn about this useful little panel, you will be wondering how you ever got along with Dreamweaver without it. What are code snippets? Code snippets is a really simple way for you to reuse pre-existing code or code that you created and want to save for later use. A double click of a button will drag that code out of the snippets panel and have it ready for your use in an instance. From complicated to the very simple, your code is always just a click away with the snippets panel. First of all, you will need to have Dreamweaver open. Oh, and then the code snippets panel. After all, we won't be able to do anything without that. If you don't have the snippets panel open already, just go to the top menu, Window, come down to Snippets, and click Snippets. That will open your panel. Take a look at the panel, and you'll see all kinds of snippets already sitting there, waiting for you to use. We have Comments, Multi-Line, Single Line. Come down further, you've got Footers. You can just click on a footer and create a footer at the bottom of your page. You have all kinds of JavaScript you can use. Cookies, date, dialog boxes, code for images, just about anything you can think of. Okay, so let's use one of these snippets. We're going to use something really easy. Just select your text right here and click on Comment Multiline double click it and that commented out your code just that simple now let's come down a little further we'll come down to loops and my snippets and this is one that I would saved myself days of the week click where you want to add this code to the page I'll add it right here and then come over here to the code and double click on it and that added your days of the week right here. And now we'll go to the browser and check it out and see what it looks like. Save the changes. And you've got the days of the week. That's simple. Just a click of the button. See these tags that are around the code? That's your JavaScript tags and that's needed. If you don't have those tags it won't come out right. I'll show you what it looks like. Take those tags off. And this is what your web page looks like. You will have code directly on your web page which is something you do not want. And if you view it in the browser that's what you'll see. that's definitely not what you want that's not the way you want it to work so you have to have those tags surrounding it so let's create one of these for ourselves we'll create our own snippet and we'll use this tag to create it the JavaScript tag we'll just copy it on the page come over to the snippets panel Click on New Snippet, name our snippet, JavaScript tag, we want this tag to wrap around. So what we want to do is have the first portion of it that goes around the top of the code in the Insert Before text box and then take this second part that goes around the bottom part of the code cut it put it in here and this will surround it if you did not want it to surround it and you just wanted to insert the code itself you would use an insert block but we want this code to surround our existing code on the page when we use it so click OK and there's our code right here now we're going to take that code and come up here and wrap it around. 
Now I'll show you how to use it. Wrap it around. Come over here, double click our new code, and that added those tags. And it made the code disappear. And we'll come back into the browser. Save changes, yes. And there's our days of the week. And we no longer have that code sitting on the page. So now it's working correctly again. So how if we wanted to edit code? We come down to this edit snippet, open it up, and then we could make any changes we want. Since we don't want to make any changes, we'll just cancel out of that. And then if you want to make a new folder, come down here, name the folder, our new snippets, you can name it anything you want. And then you have a new folder to put all your new snippets in. Well, I guess that's just about everything you need to know about creating your own code snippets. So happy snippeting, and this is Stars and Dust signing off. Until next time. Mm -hmm.